concerning Alexei Navalny, the uh, Russian politician who died in that uh, penal colony last Friday, so six days ago. There it is on the screen, Alexei Navalny's mother saying she has now been shown his body. You remember over the weekend she stood outside of that penal colony and the mortuary demanding to be shown the body and was turned away. Well, uh, finally, six days later after his death, uh, she has been shown his body. We wait for further comments from her in terms of uh, her assessment, but just that one line coming into us. Uh, so much international reaction uh, since that news broke last Friday. The latest uh, concerns Russia's foreign minister. He's at that uh, G20 gathering of foreign ministers reacting again to the sorts of things the international community have been saying. David Cameron, the UK foreign secretary, for example, saying absolutely directly, looking him in the eye and saying Russia murdered Alexei Navalny. We had those comments also overnight from President Biden. Well, uh, Russia's Sergei Lavrov saying in the last little while that the West reaction to the death of Alexei Navalny has been hysteria and said that Western countries had no right to meddle in Russia's affairs. So uh, that's the latest uh, from uh, uh, Russia's foreign minister. But uh, I return to that breaking development with Alexei Navalny's mother saying she has now been shown the body of Alexei Navalny. Another line just coming in says uh, officials uh, uh, trying to force her hand on the time and location of Navalny's funeral. So uh, the early uh, parts of uh, her reaction just coming in because, of course, since Friday, the family, the legal team, been trying to get access to the body. But uh, those are the details coming into us uh, so far. So uh, Alexei Navalny's uh, mother finally uh, getting access to uh, his body. Of course, uh, the Russian authorities uh, had said that uh, they would be conducting more tests. Officials uh, want Alexei Navalny buried in secret without mourning. We are also being told that's what the Reuters news agency also reporting. And of course, we've seen that clamp down in a variety of cities in Russia since Friday with people coming out to lay flowers and tributes. And we've seen uh, a, a pretty harsh crackdown from some of those people involved. So those are some of the latest details. That story is clearly emerging and developing. So we'll keep an eye on that and we'll uh, bring you plenty more of those details as we get them. But that's the breaking news just coming in from Russia.